Hi, this is Brian with another mini chapter from A Philosopher's Notes. This one's called Five to One, The Magic Number of Love. John Gottman can bring a married couple into his lab and, after watching them interact for a matter of minutes, can predict with 90% plus accuracy whether they'll stay together or divorce. How's he do it? He measures the ratio of positive to negative interactions between the couple. Do they criticize one another or say something kind, move away from one another, or touch each other lovingly? And he's found that couples that thrive have at least five positive interactions to every one negative interaction. Five to one, it's the magic number of love. Knowing this, my wife slash goddess slash love and I have a little ritual. Every night before we go to bed, we swap appreciations with one another. At least five things we really appreciate about the other. From little things like, I appreciate you making us green juice today, to appreciating each other's top strengths. Alexandra's are playfulness, gratitude, creativity, hope and optimism, curiosity and love of learning, and wisdom. And it's a really cool way to fall asleep. and helps us make sure we're rocking the five to one. When we have kids, we're planning to play the appreciation game with them as we tuck them in. Good times. So here's to love magic. And quick PS, speaking of appreciations, check this out. When you appreciate someone, their value appreciates. That's cool. So how can you get your five to one on the magic number of love? Five positive interactions for every one negative interaction. We need that if our relationships are going to thrive, whether it's an intimate relationship, a business relationship, relationship with our kids or friends, whatever. Five to one, the magic number of love. Hope you enjoyed. Look forward to sharing more with you soon. Have another awesome day. See you.